Hey guys, so right on here I'm back with you guys again just with another video. Now today we're looking at an issue with a generic um, Android um, Chinese tablet that's called the iRoller and that's the DX752, the iRoller. Alright, so I'm getting an error or you might be getting an error where it's saying as you can see on screen here, Google Play um, services isn't responding. Do you want to close it? And of course, this happening where the app is crashing every time. It might also say the app has stopped responding or um, basically the app has stopped functioning. So any error that sounds similar to this where your apps are crashing or giving you errors, this is how you can go about fixing it. Um, in this case, this app is actually very, or the tablet is very slow. As you can see, it shows process isn't responding. And these tablets, after a while, after being used, they do get very slow. So if you're getting apps crashing or any errors where you are um, seeing that it's frozen, as you can see, it's very slow. And basically, I'm going to show you how to fix it. All right? See, it took a little while just for the um, screen to load. So these apps, they can't take much pressure. So please do not install a lot of stuff on them, but the basics. All right? So first of all, I want to press down power and power off. All right, and this is what I want to try first in case you are getting apps freezing up and crashing or not responding. All right, so the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna hold down power and volume up, depending on your device, it might be power and volume down. You're gonna hold them until you get into this screen here that says no command. Then I want you to press up and power, and you need to hold it for a few seconds as you're seeing here. So that's it, power and up, and there you go, you should be in recovery. Now once you're in recovery, you're going to use the volume up and down to navigate and the power button to select. Now what we're going to do here is just to wipe the cache partition or wipe cache. Alright, so you're going to use the volume down and you're going to move down. Depending on your device, it might be in the last position or it could be um, in various positions. Do not choose wipe data, only wipe cache. As you can see there, I've selected wipe cache partition. I'm going to hit power. Alright, and just allow the device to do itself do this thing as you can see it's saying erasing um, a cache and just give it a little time um, it might reboot or you you might need to select the first option which is reboot but the tablet will also start back over or basically um, boot back up all right so once you go in i want you to go through again and see if your apps are responding or if they're still crashing all right so forgive me again this thing is very slow and Ultimately, if this or the other tip that I'm going to show you does not work, you might need to reset your tablet. I'll have a different video on that one. So um, you can go in and you can test the apps again. So as you can see, I was going to see if things are still crashing. All right. So I was going to find the store, which is was um, crashing before. Um, and as you can see, it's loading. And it seems to be fixed. All right. So another thing that you could try in case that did not work is to go into settings. So let's just get into settings here. Um, let's launch the settings menu. Once you go into settings, right there, uh, you're gonna go into um, apps. Once you get into settings, so forgive me and bear with me. This device is kind of slow. And you're just gonna go down to apps on your tablet. And once you go into apps, just scroll down and you're gonna find the affected app, which is Google Play Store. So there's Google Play Store. You're gonna tap on that. All right. And just give it some time and basically what's gonna happen is that it's gonna bring up a menu and you're gonna clear um, both clear cache then you're gonna clear data please note this is gonna erase your account not the entire account but it's gonna remove it from the device so you'll have to log back in to your account and try again as you can see you have to confirm all right guys Ricardo from blog tech tips with another quick tech tip Please remember you can always go over to the website www.blogtechtips.com for further tech tips. This is Ricardo saying goodbye until next time. Bye.